Hey what's going on guys, Dignal here, and in today's video I'm going to be showing you guys how to make the impact that you've just seen on screen. Uh, it's a personal favorite of mine right now, it's very very smooth, and uh, there's a lot of tips and tricks behind it. Uh, so yeah, let's get right into the tutorial. Uh, what you're going to want to start off by doing is download the preset in the description. Uh, so just go ahead and do that. After that, just go ahead and go into your clip and go fr three frames back from the impact. So one, two, three. Uh, split the clip, click on the little FX button. And uh, after that, just go ahead and import the preset that is actually in the description. Uh, so right here. Uh, and I'm going to walk you guys through uh, a bit of the actual preset here so that you guys actually understand what's going on and that you can change it and replicate it without, uh, you know, which causing yourself too much confusion uh so first of all we have the twixter thing of course it's just you know normal twixter quite easy uh after that we have the shake this is actually the tilt shake and it is set to a slow fade which is what actually makes the smooth sort of tilt shake here uh now if you want to make the uh you know the, the tilt slower you can go and change the frequency to say three uh so that's going to make it slower uh and below that we have the z distance which is how much it zooms in you can change that as well and uh, underneath that, we have the uh, the shake that is uh, sort of up and down. If you can see, it, it's sort of like going up a bit and like bouncing, sort of, that is this. And uh, after that, we have the motion blur. This is BCC motion blur. And this is a very, very easy effect that you can use to actually hide uh, vector or motion vectors. So uh, with Twixter, I'm sure you've all, you know, uh, recognized that there are a couple, you know, draggy sort of things. Like it looks like soup, pretty much. And uh, if you apply motion blur, it actually hides this and uh, makes it sort of it makes it sort of look intentional in a way, uh, which it obviously isn't. But you know, it's it still sort of looks decent. And you know, underneath that we have VCC film glow, which is just you know the film glow. It just makes it a bit brighter on impact, which is quite cool. Underneath that, we have flicker. We all know what flicker is. And then we have some HSL saturation adjust, which just, you know, increases the saturation on the impact, uh, just like that. And uh, that is pretty much the entire preset. Uh, what you also need to do to make the, uh, the effect on screen is to apply a light leak preset. Now, uh, in order to actually do this, just go ahead and drag the, uh, the light leak on. Uh, go ahead and delete the uh, the audio track. Go ahead and hold Control and drag it in, and then just split it uh, at the end right here, and then just fade it in from the start. Uh, preferably like a uh, a slow fade like that. And in order to actually get them, and you just go up here to this little line and you right click, and you'll get all of these different uh, options. And once you've done that, just go ahead and go to the track options. You click on Add right here if you don't have this button right here just go and right click on this hamburger icon or left click and just click on compositing mode and you just select add and once you've done all of those things you will actually see that uh we have a pretty cool effect right here just like that and obviously you can choose which sort of colors you want uh you can change it both via the uh the hue saturation settings in the uh, <laughs> in the Vegas and you can also change it depending on what uh, what you download uh, but yeah as you can see it looks quite cool in my opinion and uh, there are you know several ways you can change the preset and stuff like that uh, but yeah I hope you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial if you did make sure to like down below comment subscribe all the good shit and I'll see you guys in a couple days and uh, peace